actually, I'm Yanz, and this is our my special guest, Gabby. And today we are doing uh, <laughs> the try and weird food combinations. And I kind of got the inspiration um, from Alicia Marie because she tried like the Nutella and the pizza, and I want to try that because that looks like that could be pretty bomb. So I invited her along to try it because she wanted to try some weird food combinations as well. That's my idea. And, and no, it wasn't. But. <laughs> But I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you aren't subscribed yet, you should definitely subscribe and also like this video and hit the notification bell that's next to the subscribe button. And you know, and you can also follow Gabby on Instagram. You know, yeah, I don't know at Queen underscore G underscore T Park. And I am at one of my logical sisters. You know, <laughs> don't follow. You know, and she has been in some videos already, so go watch those videos as well. But anyway, thank you guys for watching, and let's get on into the video. we are going to try is pickles and Oreos and this is actually her idea she wanted to try this I'm going to vlog style this so you can see the angle of it you know so first you start with your Oreos you, you open it and then you get a pickle oh this is one that Alicia Marie and Shane Dawson did yeah yeah okay Ew. oh the pickle juice it's so stay. because our camera woman is currently in it, you know? Yeah. But we are gonna free? do two things at one because she took too long to get here and now it's kinda cold. And we still need to melt the chocolate. So we're gonna kill two birds with one stone, you know. But, you know, no birds were harmed in the filming of this. <laughs> <laughs> and just put on all the chocolate and melt it in the microwave and see how this goes. This is gonna be pretty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so nice. <laughs> Whatever, um, All right, and to the microwave we go. Now we have some melted chocolate over our pizza. Mm -mm. It's hot, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just, uh, it's hot, bro. It's <laughs> <laughs> actually not bad, though. It's hot. That's not bad. That is not bad. <laughs> that is not bad, though. I can't <laughs> Stir it around. All right, that's gross. Yeah, you see this nice color. Oh, ah, nasty. Oh, no. oh, okay. All right. Oh, you tried. <laughs> Has any YouTuber liked that one? Mm. That's not terrible. You cannot taste the milk. Mm -hmm. You nice. can or can't? Yeah. Well. But okay. they will get soggy. The milk it's would also the milk would also help it not be so spicy. Mm -hmm. You can't taste so much. Mm -hmm. It's so spicy. I was watching a video and he a big spoon so he was like, you would think the milk would cut the spices. Mm -hmm. It just is like it's like if you put like hot Cheetos in water. Mm -hmm. It's just like soggy hot Cheetos, huh? Ew. It doesn't even, not soggy, but. It's not soggy, yeah. It's yeah. Just but it just. 
it's not terrible like it's not like as bad as i expected it but you can still have the spice and it's just like you can't taste the milk but you know i wouldn't yeah, particularly good. eat this all the time though i wouldn't eat it all the time but it's good because you can't taste the milk yeah it's not as bad as i think so let's give this a go mm, you know go mm. i like it yeah. So the second one we're doing is Nutella and pizza and this one I am kind of I really 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 want to try because this is the one Alicia Marie tried and she said it was actually good uh, and the chocolate one was pretty good so Nutella is just like a different kind of chocolate flavor so also it's good. I can't have it yeah she's allergic to nuts and we're not sure if it's just like peanuts or like walnuts hazelnuts but we're not gonna test that today um, yep. so this one's just for me to try Ooh. Yeah. Okay, oh yeah. All right. Does it taste the same? Is it? It kind of tastes like a chocolate, yeah, but just Nutella, you know, you have the hazelnut taste, mm -hmm. but I mean, you wouldn't know, but. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think she would. <laughs> yeah. You wouldn't know, but <laughs> you understand, you get it. I mean, you know what hazelnut tastes like either. Bro. It's like it's like it tastes like Nutella on on pizza. It's exactly what it tastes like. I mean, what it what it is. I would assume so. I hope so. <laughs> it's not terrible, and I think I think I kind of prefer this to the chocolate because it gives it another flavor. So um, I'm gonna give this a, a thumbs up too. So our last one, which I'm not really excited for, is. A peanut butter and mayo and cheese sandwich. So uh, a PBCM. Not excited for this, but you know, you gotta do it. You gotta try stuff. So this nice jar of peanut butter, you know, mayo for that. Spread that. And of course, I'm gonna use one because not being wasteful. Hashtag not wasteful. What was my idea? It was her. She's like the brains behind everything. Here. No, not really. Um, there, you know. Just like making a PB and J, but it's a PB and M and C. Now where things get kind of gross, the mayonnaise. Uh, it can get kind of gross. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ew. Okay. Ew. So I know peanut butter and cheese is supposed to be good, but if you're adding mayo into the equation, I don't. I don't think this is gonna taste. Good. And now to add our cheese. I'm, I'm, I was trying to think of some like some type of funny joke that's shit cheesy, you know? So I could be like, wow, that was so cheesy. But all right, and let's pick. It's oh fine, no. Bro. no. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <sighs> I really can't Sorry. taste the mayo. It's like basically just the cheese. And the, yeah, the peanut butter the added a thicker good. layer of mayonnaise. Okay. We got a claw garter. Nasty. You want to sit up? Not as terrible as I thought it was going to be, honestly. I thought I was going to like hate it tremendously. I guess you can't really... I mean, I don't really hate mayonnaise. And I, I like peanut butter and cheese, so you know. But I don't think I'm going to... Actually finishes because just the thought of it just makes me stick to, sick to my stomach. But yeah, I, I'm gonna give that an and too because it's it's pretty decent. So that is gonna be the end of our trying weird uh, food combinations that people actually like, which is I don't know how. Like I mean, the Nutella, the chocolate. Okay, I get that on pizza. That's that's pretty good. But pickles and Oreos, that was that was gross. disgusting. And the Cheetos and the milk. You couldn't taste the milk, so it was fine. It was I. And then the mayonnaise and the halos. The may <laughs> the mayo, the peanut butter, and the cheese. It's all right, but just thinking about it and thinking about the ingredients inside of it is kind of like, bleh, it's like puking my mouth. But thank you, Gary, for being in this video and trying these weird food combinations with me. What was your favorite one? Ah, uh, my favorite one, the Nutella the pizza. Mm -hmm. My probably the chocolate and pizza or the. I mean, comment down below what you think your favorite would have been because I would like to know, like, maybe you guys like the Oreo and pickles. Like, tell me if some of these are your favorite uh, ones because I 
uh, I also think that we got the wrong pickles, right? Uh huh. That's not dill pickles. Nope. Maybe that. Exactly. <laughs> bread and butter. We should have read it. Oh, I didn't read it. Bad. Thank you guys for watching and visiting Yans. You know, you can also check out the other videos because why? Why wouldn't you like? Why, why not? Huh? Uh, also, Gabby, uh, you can also leave a comment down below telling me what. If you like any of these comfortable combinations, if you would try them, or which one you think you would like the most, or which one you think you would hate the most, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. I will see you next Sunday, hopefully, with our Romeo and Juliet video. Uh, bye! She's not consistent.